please rise for a brief moment of silence followed by the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, New Brighton. Today is Wednesday, April 20th, 2022. Students, please check the lost and found for missing items before they are donated. Seniors, your green honors and assembly forms are due and guidance by April 28th. Any current 9th through 11th graders interested in becoming part of the Lion Nets will have an opportunity to try out for the squad on April 26th. There will be four practices to prepare for the tryouts on Wednesday, April 21st through Friday, April 23rd, and Monday, April 25th. If you cannot make every practice, you are still able to try out. Practices and tryouts will be held in the middle school gym from 3.30 to 6.30 p.m. Tryouts may run longer depending on how many are there. If there's any questions, please contact Ms. Bielstein. Seniors, a link for a scholarship and deadlines is attached. Do not let this opportunity go by. Any student interested in the archery next year can contact Mr. Flinger at the number on the document. Students, be sure to reserve your copy for the 2022 yearbook sales ends on April 30th. You can order online or with Ms. Runat's yearbooks are $70. Attention juniors and seniors, the SAT is taking place here at New Brighton on June 4th. The registration deadline is May 5th. If you need any help signing up for this, you can go to guidance and ask Ms. Hubbard for the information. Now to sports. Good luck to the baseball team at their away game against Mohawk today. Good luck to the softball team at their home game against Quaker Valley today at 345. Now to the weather. Today's weather is cloudy with a 10% chance of precipitation, a high of 48 and a low of 34. Now back to the news. Happy birthday to Andrew Nappi and Joey Pacheco. Today for lunch is French toast sticks and pizza. Many subject to change. Have a good day.